Welcome to the Health, Social Care and Child Care Department. Thank you for taking an interest in our course. We are able to offer the GCSE, WJEC, Health and Social Care and Child Care double award approved by Qualifications Wales. Your study. So the Health and Social Care, Child Care course is awarded by City and Guilds WJC Consortium. It's a double GCSE award in health, social care and childcare and is suitable for you aged 14 to 16, years 10 and 11. You will learn about the development and care of individuals throughout the life cycle from conception to later adulthood. You will have the opportunity to develop your understanding of influences on human growth, development, behaviour and well-being. You'll also gain an understanding of the social, physical, emotional and cultural needs of people who use care and support services and recognise that each individual has a unique blend of abilities and needs. You will gain an understanding of how service provision in Wales supports the development and well-being of individuals to be able to make informed decisions now and later in adult life. The course has been designed to include contemporary issues in relation to the provision of ethical and sustainable health and social care and childcare systems in Wales. Studying with us at the college will give you the key knowledge and understanding of health, social care and childcare within our excellent facilities. We have top of the range resources and highly experienced staff, many of whom are current practitioners within health, social care or childcare. We offer a knowledge base from our professionals within social services, midwifery, nursing and the psychology departments. We have fully equipped simulation suites for both health, social and childcare to provide our learners with some excellent hands-on opportunities. We also have two virtual reality suites which provide a safe, immersive learning environment for learners to explore anatomy and physiology and offer a potential learning environment to which to explore patient-centred care linking theory to practice. Here are some of the images that we've taken from some of our students within those hands-on facilities. We have got a fully equipped hospital ward that offers the opportunity to engage and carry out learning experiences along with our social care room and our virtual reality suites. The structure of the course is broken into two parts, year 10 and year 11. It's a double award. You will study two units in year 10 and two units in year 11. In year 10, you'll look at human growth, development and well-being, and you'll also study the promotion and maintaining of health and well-being. Moving on into year 11, you will study unit three, health, social care and child care in the 21st century, and unit four, promoting and supporting health and well-being to achieve positive outcomes. In unit one, you'll gain knowledge and understanding of human development across the life cycle and ways in which this may be affected. You'll learn about how individuals can take control of their care and health and wellbeing and how early intervention and prevention can support growth and development of individuals. We will look at a range of services that are available within Wales to both children and adults to support their holistic development. Within Unit 2, you will gain knowledge and understanding of a range of health, social care and childcare services in Wales and how these services promote and maintain health and well-being of the nation. 
Within unit two, you're able to focus in on an area of your interest, looking at a target group and carrying out research that interests you. Moving on to year 11, unit three, in this unit, you'll gain knowledge and understanding of ethical issues affecting service provision in Wales and providing and supporting sustainable health and social care within the 21st century. Within unit four, you'll gain knowledge and understanding of the ways health and social and childcare services support individuals within Wales to achieve health and wellbeing for all. You'll also be able to develop a range of skills that are non-assessed. This means that you will be promoted to actively engage in the study of health and social care and childcare, and you also also develop as an effective, independent learner. You'll develop your critical and reflecting thinking skills with inquiring minds. This is particularly important within the research tasks that you will undertake. You'll develop an awareness of career pathways available within the health and social care and childcare sectors, and you'll look at these in some depth. You'll explore what's available within these sectors, along with what requirements are needed to undertake the career pathway. You'll appreciate a range of perspectives on the impact of health and social care and childcare services on wider society and how this interlinks. You'll also develop and apply knowledge and understanding and skills to contemporary issues in a range of health and social care and childcare contexts. This has never been so important. The GCSE in Health, Social Care and Childcare is assessed through 40% internal assessment and 60% external assessments. Candidates must successfully complete externally set and internally marked assessments. In year 10, you will sit one external exam and two internally marked assessments. Your external exam is one hour and 30 minutes and will be sat in school. Your internal assessments are undertaken under controlled assessment and they will be carried out in college. In year 11, again, you'll sit one externally sat exam in school and two internally marked assessments. Here we have some Quote from our student experience. We think it's really important that our students are heard. They have a voice and they are the best candidates to tell you what they think of the course. So here are a few quotes from them. Thank you.